Good day for Brandon Jones as well. He's led 30 circuits. Two remaining for Noah Gregson. But he mainly wants to get back and see that white flag so he knows That's we will it. not get another restart. And so this is what he's thinking about. Like, come on, white flag. And, and you're thinking about it all the way down the back stretch here. Like, you know there's going to be a caution right now. Like, it always goes through my mind in this scenario. And you come off the corner and you see the white flag waving. He's going to see it right now. Right now, he's thinking, okay, boys, now you guys can go wherever you guys want. <laughs> one lap to go. Sponsored by Credit One Bank. 115 laps out front for Noah Gregson. So good to begin the year, but he's yet to capture the checkered flag. Today, he's going to dust him in the desert. Noah Gregson, the man at Phoenix. Checkered flag. Hell yeah, Noah Gregson. Sir, thank you, guys. Great, great job, guys. Great execution. Thank you, pick crew. Thank you, Luke. Everyone. Johnny Morton, thank you. Great job. Very, very, very well deserved victory today. First four races in the top three. Hey, and the last time Luke Lambert won a race, it was here, March 17th, with Ryan Newman in Cup. No way. I remember that race, too. Welcome back to Victory Lane. Wow. And the last driver to start the season with four straight top threes, Elliott Sadler, 2012. Guess who his crew chief was? Luke Lambert. <laughs> Guess where he won? Phoenix. <laughs> wow. For Gregson, career win number six. And when you factor in what he did late last year and early this season, it has been so impressive. And another stellar day for Junior Motorsports. Three of their cars inside the top ten. And we knew they'd be strong here. Junior Motorsports has always been strong at Phoenix for, for whatever reason. Uh, they, they've always had cars that can contend for victories. And, and today, obviously, no difference uh, uh, from that. Noah Gregson fast up there. Josh Berry, we, we commented about Al Geyer, the speed he had in his car today. Uh, they, they all had quick cars. Here's what's scary about him when you look at the upcoming schedule. Next month, we go to Richmond, we go to Martinsville. He won both those races the last time we went there. I think we're going to get a little smoke show here, I think. Oh, yeah. He's ready to go. He's warming his tires up for us. Yeah. <laughs> I love burnouts. Yeah, burnouts are just cool. <laughs> Donut somewhere in there. Yeah, yeah. That's the best way to do it. I don't think he knows where he's at either. Hey, when you lose the car, the driver inside there doesn't know where he's at either, by the way. Oh, there goes oh, the truck a piece of, tire. Piece of the tire. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants a souvenir? It's not done yet. Oh, yeah. boy, There's no more tire left. I don't think he has a left for either. I think he's got them both. Oh, yeah, he, he got both. Huh? Sign of a good burnout. You go till something breaks. Did it. Cool place to park, too. Yeah. <laughs> he said if he won at Daytona, he'd go swimming in Lake Lloyd. I'm not sure what you do when you win in the desert. He might climb a cactus or something like that out here. <laughs> you never know it, Noah. <laughs> The fans love him, and now you know why. To burn the rubber over here. <laughs> <laughs> Standing. And now we're going to climb the fence. There's a lot of banking right there. Just uh, pointing that out there, guys. There's a, there's a lot of banking at that point right off of turn four.
You talk about dangerous celebrations. Last time we were here, Hemrick does the backflip. Now Gregson climbing the fence. This always makes me nervous. At least Noah has his helmet on. How about the rest of us guys? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey, those guys are pretty high. Yeah, I don't know if I'd do it. No. <laughs> I was going to say, if I was on a team that was able to win a race, I think it would be this one so I could celebrate with him. I definitely would be out on climbing the fence. <laughs> this, I'm pretty sure this team celebrates pretty hard. <laughs> sure <to win. laughs> and they come over to give him the flag, and he immediately talks with the NASCAR official and points out who he would like to see get it in the grandstand, and that is awesome. All right, he's got a fan. There you go. For life. <laughs> what a win. What a celebration, Regan. What a, what a celebration. What a celebration is correct, Adam. No, Gregson, never short for celebrations. You are a wonderful race today. That race car looked like it was nearly perfect. You have had a great start to the season. How does this one feel? Uh, it feels great to get the 50th anniversary Bass Pro Shot Camaro. And victory lane but most importantly thank you all you badass race fans for coming out you guys are awesome you guys are loud we love you thanks for coming to phoenix this team the pit crew everybody who makes this possible with uh you know, johnny morris jp z-man z-man you got a, a wedding coming up i'm sorry i think we're gonna miss it but love you buddy uh caught the track on fire which is awesome but you know the pit crew executed great his team's been on a roll so far this year, all top three finishes, first four races. Just uh, you know, can't thank everybody enough for all their hard work and try and keep it going. race fans thanks for watching our video for all nascar on fox news content and the best clips from fox sports be sure to follow and subscribe to our channel